Okay, all right, all right, all right. Okay. All right. Elden Ring. And Adventure Time. We. Where am I? Somewhere. Somewhere. At some point. At some time. Ooh. All right. So. Last we left off. We did this stuff. The fancy stuff at the big place with the tall person and the shenanigans. This time, it's probably going to be another short one. But, if I remember correctly, there's a thing I've been, you know, just kind of leaving around and not doing for no real reason. Let's go do that. Let's let's go do that. Which probably won't even take that long, to be honest. It depends. Depends on a very specific thing that I can choose to either fight or ignore. If I ignore it, well, then we don't have to care about anything. But if I decide to say hello. Probably gonna take a bit. Probably going to take a fair bit. I just remembered. Magic damage. Resistances. Hmm. Good to have you in your corn. Boy, I really hope I'm going the right I'm not I'm not going the right way at all. This is the complete opposite of where I wanted to go. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Good. We're good here. Good. Oh, yeah. Well, this looks a pretty place to run through. Let's see, you know, the little underground space zone nebula. It's, no. It's very pretty. Definitely not because of some sort of horrible calamity involving a freakish space centipede dragonfly thing falling from the sky and eating people. No, no, no way. Not at all. Alrighty, and uh, up we go. Man, they really love their massive, massive elevators. Hello, Moonlight Altar. You are a very fancy looking zone. I mean, kind of, sort of. It's weird, because, I mean, it's. On the one hand, it's technically the same as all the other side zones, but. Oh, hey, I can talk to Melna. What's up? I. What, what are you doing here? Think not of the kindling. I shall see to that. Ah, what yes, I that. I, you know, don't worry about that. Is to make the journey to the snowy mountain tops of the giants, far above the clouds. I know. I'm asking you to commit a cardinal sin, but it must be done. To Are you reach gonna say that every time beyond. I sit at a grace now? That that's just a. Is the path I wish chat? to I can have whenever. What is your mind? Because I mean, I'll be honest. That's. It's not bad, because then, hey, you can actually hang out and level me up. But alright, cool. You can, you can see you, Melna. We don't, see that, we don't do that often. Quite rare. Time to bring on the party. Hey, Adula. I remember you when you ran away like a huge coward. I do damage. Okay, I do damage.
I'm up against the wall. Alright, that's not ideal. Also, probably not for Reaver 8. Yep. Yep. It was not. It was not. It was decidedly poor. Gotta be careful with being that aggro, because, yeah, if you just get stuck up against that, uh, little cathedral there, you're gonna have a hard time escaping horrible magic fall fire. Well, at least I have a horse. Go. Oh, donkey. Friend. Use friend. Let's just go with friend. I don't know what you are, Torrent, but I like it. that one bit. That, on the other hand, I'm not so confident about. Yeah, yeah, I, I lack confidence, was well advised. Oh, my lord, well, oh, I, hmm. Probably pop the uh, little, little dingle dong doodle of blue. Burn arc that, yes. Because apparently I'm going to need that. I'm going to be getting one shot. I just got to dump like 20 more stats to my bit. I feel so wrong! It's not how it's supposed to be. It's not right, but. Ugh. I guess I just got to. Alright, where are my souls? Uh, hold on, I do like a wee... Oh, there he is. Alright, cool. Oh, no poop. You shove me away from those. I need those. Oh, oh there you go. Well, well, that... Even with the rune arc, that's one hand. Mmm. Cool. Good. Hmm. Ah, this is gonna be a thing. That's what I get. That's what I get for not doing more off-stream grinding. Some say it ruins stuff, but on the other hand, it makes you not die. Well, lesser of two evils, really. So down for that. That's okay too. I can deal with that. That's not the attack I thought it was going to be. I thought there was going to be fire breaths or magic fire. Ah. I'm not gonna waste any more rune arcs if I'm just gonna keep getting one shot even with it on. Now we just have to try and be smart. And not die. Oh boy. They're my two greatest weaknesses. Oh, that is not your stomp. Shame. Really hoping for the stomp. I don't like. Ooh, that fucker. Herbarized me. Damn. 
You're gonna phase out here, aren't you? Yep, there you go. Great. That's fine, that's fine. You don't get the health back. Just annoying. Yes, really, really quite annoying. Is it? Okay, so it does not reset. Your roar status. Make it, survived. Crazy that a whole ass dragon just stomping on you from the sky does less damage than most of the other things he's been doing. She's been doing. I don't know. Duel is whatever Duel wants to be. Probably a lady. I don't know. Yes, yes, you're a very big, scary dragon. It's going to be in my ass for quite a while, I'm sure. It's just, okay, that's just your reposition. That is fine. Please do, yep, fire breath, thank you. More animals, how dare you? They will be remembered. What is this? What is this? This is, okay, this is the stop. Deal with the stop. Deal with the stop real easy. With the snap drag. Stomp's slightly more empty, but also fine. Alright, what is this? Reposition. Okay. Position to fire breath. Good, 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 good. You're gonna face out on me, I can just tell. Man, I really like that stomp that keeps missing. That's a that's a good stomp. You should yeah, keep doing that, thank you. That is exactly what I was asking for. Alright, phase out. I know you want it. you this is your phase out time. Roll forward. You will roll forward. <sighs> I think about that sun. I don't get it. It's really an incredibly simple attack, but boy, I just cannot handle it. That, 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 that's, that, that is not at all supposed to happen. Okay. Phase out. Please, Lord, phase out. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. That was getting a bit much there. There. It's a good one. Good run. I'm feeling it. I'm really feeling it. I got greedy. Okay, but you missed, so you know what? All evens out. There we go. Took a bit longer than I wanted, but hey. I'll take that. And I'll also take all all of that. Especially the Moonblade. That is perfect for me. Oh yeah, and I could have made this so much easier myself by just running past and grabbing that. Grabbing this grace. Oh well. Got some handy Starlight shards. Plenty, plenty, plenty. 
and T to do whatever I want with. second. Ah, we sit. And you know what? Yeah, let's just, let's just dump it all into it. Let's just bump up that health, because I apparently, boy, do I need it. Oh, I mean, okay, okay. 60 in, then all bigger. That's, yeah, okay. I'm good with that. I'm, I'm good with that. Also, let me look at that blade. Probably good. Two int. Cold magic greatsword, dripping blow, blue black reptile of frost. Adula, a devourer of sorcerers, was bested by Rani, subsequently swore a nightly oath to her dark moon. Cool. I will probably stop that on somewhere. That seems I haven't used this at all, so let's just that out of here. And now we know more magic. And our more magical. We can do some magical things. We can also fall into some deep, dark, dank holes. So, Granny, as you can tell, been up to some shit. Been up to some shit. But she said she was gonna do, so hey, good on her. She goes. Oh, she's back. Great, cool. So it was thee who would become my lord. Perhaps I needn't have warned thee. I am pleased, however. Thou art a fitting choice. I go now to the night sky. It is there I shall find mine order. I bid thee. Travel the path of the Lord, and once all is done, we shall see each other once more. Poor thing, Ranny. But also, the most important part of all Dark Moon Great Sword. Ah! I don't know if I'm going to change up my whole style for bringing this thing on, but I mean, it's the freaking Dark Moon Greatsword. A Moon Greatsword, bestowed by a Carrion Queen upon her spouse to honor long-standing tradition, one of the legendary armaments. Rani's sigil is a full moon, cold and leaden, and the sword is but a beam of its light. Unique skill, Moonlight Greatsword. Uh, exist in every FromSoft game ever. Well, not everyone. Don't have it in Sekiro and... It's probably some other game, but I don't have it. But, hey. Uh, if you just want 
You want the big sword. You want the magic. Look no further. This is all you need. Don't you get magical beam powers with this? Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh. And then you get cute. But this, you know, uh, this gets to be considered. This gets to be thought about a lot. And honestly, I will probably, probably use it. You know what? Well, yeah. Let's just see how much we can upgrade that. It should be using somber stones. Makes it much, much easier to upgrade. Well, I took you for my magic. Yeah, I know, I know. You saw me leave the room and assume I died. Now you are. Plus seven. Alright, cool. Alright, I will keep an eye out for those. And we'll heavily consider using that. But now, that all taken and us uh, gotten all married and happy. Let's go down here to a place that I have been purposely ignoring for, like, literally no reason other than... I'm stupid. Now we get to head to the party tower. Full of, uh, friends and... Nothing but good things. Nothing but great, great times and nice people and definitely not some kind of incredibly annoying NPC invasion. No, no, that'd be nuts. That would be bonkers. Really sure I probably should have just come down here to grab this grace, just naturally. So... We do have an item to use here. We got it already from Randy. But, there's still things to do before putting that, so we'll do those first. And we will have plenty of time to come back down here. Because we're probably gonna come back down here a lot. No, I can one-shot you guys. That's gonna make things a lot easier. Granted, yeah, I mean... Point that I'm at, coming in here... I'm a little overtuned, but you know what? That's fine. This area deserves having to deal with that. I already gotta deal with that. Best part about spellcasting NPCs. They have no limits on how often they can cast. They just go. Means I actually don't have to worry about that because I did so much damage that she skipped phases. Perfect. Because normally uh, that little preceptor Miriam there would be on the other end of this bridge taking pot shots at me the entire time. No, not fun. Not fun. Especially if you don't have the health to survive a single one of those. Which, hey, guess what? Odds are you don't when you first run in here. You were just bit pumping your vigor like there's no tomorrow. Alright, I got to go immediately to the fun zone. Ooh. 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 Remember, I can... I can fight back. I'll play. play.
just... Ow. Yeah. Fun fact, if uh, you try going up the ladder, not only can she shoot you while you're still going up there, ow, okay, I thought you left, but no, you're just teleporting freely. When you're on the floor up above, she can shoot the floor, and then with that bow she shoots, that's got an AOE explosion on it, that can fit through the floor, if you're up above. But there's no safety, you have to deal with her. Free teleport is kind of busted. And boy, it makes her the worst. Because there's no time she can't teleport. If she's casting, she can teleport. If she's getting hit, she can teleport. And wow, I'm kind of shocked she didn't there, but hey, okay. Works for me! Thank you for making my life so much easier. Now that makes sense. You will be And off we go. Then. Time for the easy part. And then the harder part, much, much later on. And by much later, I mean not that much later, but a little bit later. Longer than no time at all. Please don't, Mr. Rat. Please don't. Just, just... For my sake, just take a rent check. Call it a day. You got, you got stuff to do. And no time to be dealing with me. Ow. This. And we are good here. Now, we head back to the bottom. And we make the climb all over again. Using everyone's favorite technique, magical upside down statues. And now we've got mm, all flipped and flopped and turned upside down. I should have called back the elevator. That might have helped a bit. Mm. Yeah, well. Problem for another day. And in the meantime, I have more pressing problem. Leave us alone. You have to keep coming back. In a jackass with your sniping. Granted, this version of you is not much of a threat, thankfully, due to geometry being what it is. I still don't like you, Miriam. I still really do not like you. Hi, hey, how you doing? Yeah, and this also sucks. That's, that's that's not ideal. That's quite poor. Ah, it's a bit more what I expected. I forgot that she gets a little soldier buddy to help her out there. That's uh, unfortunate, regrettable, and not ideal.
No. She's playing her own game. Facts. Why not? Why not? This is how you want to play, Miriam? That's how we'll play. Sure you don't want to walk a couple steps forward there, Miriam? You do it. It'd be great. We'd all love it. Alright. And she's gone. You know what? Fine. Cool. Perfect. My life's a lot easier to get over there. Handing out the somber twos, nice things. Don't need them, but hey. Maybe in the future, when I feel like just grabbing a bunch of extra crap. Confidence. Confidence. Man, why did you spawn? Sweet time this time, but last time you're just all over this. Very paying you. Up and on that, buddy. Quit and like beat her up because she's kind of a jerk. Alright, jumping attacks do not work on jumping hands. You probably remember that. Oh wow, I did her all the way down there, damn. Like this. Stop it. Stop it. Enough of you. Away. And lucidity. Cut to it. Believe you build up with sleep and madness. Okay. The carry knights never waver. Oh lord. Oh no, look at you. Survive the backstab. Good enough little nugget. Okay, we'll play, we'll play, we'll play. We can play. You did it, you did it, you did it. Careful look around. I don't think there's anything up here. Yeah, no. And move it down. And another little hop. Downward. Oh, God. Careful, though, camera. Because these chains are in the way. It doesn't mean you gotta make me walk to my death. Right. And grab a you. And down we go. Or up we go. You know, it's really hard to tell. This tower's definitely flipped. Not flipped on the outside, but it's flipped on the inside. So us going down is technically also going up. But try not to think about it too much. Because, hey, it's magic. They don't gotta explain shit. So, honestly, considering how you get the cutscene, flipping it over, and then also for leaving, wouldn't be surprised if those are actually little teleports. Just little disguised tricks to make you think you're in one place when you're in another. Alright. Perfect. Yeah. 
Here we go! Earth, absolutely nothing. We'll get in our way. Jog down this nice long bridge to the fancy divine tower right there. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. No problems. No issues. Oh no, a fat man. We're doomed. God, fat man with a really long head. And long reach. Very long reach. And you got skin guys are gross. And I have not fought one of you in a very long time, so I completely forget the right timings for your dodges. So that's gonna be great. This is why I said, oh boy. It's gonna be a short stream today. Souls gone. Yep. company here. We got better manners than that. Speaking of polite company, now he's a fatty. An even bigger fatty boom -blatty. And I... Wow, okay. I thought you were going to do that a lot longer. Ow. Please don't. Thank you for not. Then then I got greedy because I just wanted to hit him one more time instead of just dodging or healing and God. Ah, oh, I brought it on myself, but it still hurts so much. Alright, he definitely takes a lot more damage than I feel like I remember him though. Maybe the rate of magic. I don't know, but I can pretend. That's not gonna be as hard as a doula, I feel. Just do it like this. A little bit. Ow. Okay, rude. Please don't stab my horse. Ow. Okay, well, you didn't stab my horse, so hey. Thanks for listening. I really should know better than to do the horseback combat. Like, it's useful for some of the big world enemies. Like, the dragons, you can, you can fight a dragon on horseback the whole time. Guys like these, if you're not getting big, big chunks of distance in between their swings, you're just gonna get hit since you don't have, you know, an actual dodge. Aside from your dismount. Which, okay, well, I guess they might have changed that, because I thought you were supposed to have iframes when you're jumping off your horse, so jumping on. It was me, I guess. died already. It's gonna happen again. And then maybe at some point you'll actually die instead of just coming close to death. That's the dream, that's the plan. That is the hope of Stan the Man. Good, fat so. I don't appreciate what you're doing with that. Don't do damage, but it's still rude. Wow, okay. 
Too early. Chill. Couldn't chill. Was panicked. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, thank you. What would happen if I just ignored him? Probably nothing. I probably could without a problem on that, because I don't see any fog walls. But he's really just here to be here. So if I didn't want to be here, I wouldn't have to be. Alright, throw a fireball. Come on. You know you want it. Throw a fireball. Don't make me do what you don't want me to do. All right, all right. But that's how we're doing this. There you go, that's what I wanted. Granted, I wanted you to not be surrounded by a ring of fire when you were doing that, but hey, beggars can't be choosers. You're chunking up. Cool. Unfortunately for you, you have very poor turning, my friend. But you could absolutely hit me through that geometry. I, I believe in you. I trust you can. Good time. Okay, you good? Oh, God! Okay, well, see? I told you. I knew you could do it. You didn't believe in yourself, buddy, but I believed in you. Oh, are we doing it? Glad you decided to change it up, at least. Ow! It's gone. If you want to jump up into the sky, that'd be pretty rad, I'll be honest. Yeah, I mean, that, that works too, I guess. Yeah, that, that, see? You're doing the thing. You're doing the thing I was really looking forward to you doing. Thank you. Granted, I don't really know what I get from this, but, I mean, it's fun to watch. Oh, yeah, I can hit you with this when you're doing that. That's cool. Ow, all right, that, I disagree, but, you know, ow, oh my god. All right, maybe that wasn't as good as I thought it was going to be. Right, lock on to you, oh my god. Why would I not lock on? Oh, that was two times. Two times the lock on just said it. Nah, nah. Why? Why? Damn it. Ugh. Important information, though. Google is Moonblade. Uh, it ignores geometry. So that's fun. I'm surprised they would actually let you have, you know, a spell that works like an enemy attack. Right, you got your tail whipped. How about that? Good. Let your fireball. And the dance continues. You love to see it. You love to see it. Alright, well, yep, yep, you're doing your chunk rules. Alright, that's cool, chunk rules. that, but it wouldn't just let me lock on when he was just walking after me. God! There we go. Just that easy. And now we have some delightful flesh we can wear if we really want to. It's like being just covered in the skin of the gods. That other people have, you know, decided to skin and fashioned clothes and make you look like a big old fatty fatty. Fun, it's fun, it's good times, good time. Everyone loves it. Alright. Up to adventure. Up to the mysterious mystery.
mysterious proportions. It's just Adventure Time going nuts. Killing bosses, doing cleanup, and we still haven't even gone to one of the major areas of the game. Ah, oh, why, Elden Ring, why do you have so much going on for you? Why do you have so much, so, 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 so much? I didn't even get a level off the guy, I realized. That's... I mean, not unsurprising but slightly sad at least for me ah well we uh get to hang out here with uh this is Rani this is uh this is her actual body which you know I've seen better days, you'd say. Ew. Kinda cool. You can actually see a little, like, uh, a brooch and little jewels and stuff. Bits of red on the head? Might be a redhead in actuality. Who knows? Hell. Also, now that I look at it, Roach and the little red scarf around the neck. It does remind me of your Raya Lucarian stuff. That which I mean, hey, makes sense considering, you know daughter of the person who was in charge of that. Fancy. Fancy fancy. I'm kind of disappointed that no one was saying Visions of Wife, but I also don't know if you can say Visions of Wife, so I'm just going to leave now. I'm gonna head down here. See what's up with Pia, because we may have possibly just collected a fancy key item for her, but before I give it to her, I should remember to read it. So we got... Curse Mark of Death, a curse mark carved into Lunar Princess's Ran bleh, bleh. Lunar Princess Rani's discarded flesh, also known as the Half Wheel Wound of the Centipede. This curse mark was carved at the moment of death of the first demigod and should have taken the shape of a circle. However, two demigods perished at the same time, breaking the curse mark into two half wheels. Rani was the first of the demigods whose flesh perished, while the Prince of Death perished in soul alone. Where's Talisman? Uh, targets for talisman. Engraved with the legend of a queen, a young astrologer gazed at the night sky as she walked. She had always chased the stars every step of her journey. Then she met the full moon, and in time, the astrologer became a queen. That is more than likely referring to Renala over at Ronnie, but eh, yeah, you know. Same family. Same stuff. Hello, please take away 5% of my health. I don't really want you to, but I can't really stop you. This is the other Hallowbrand. How did you... Oh, my utmost thanks. With this, Godwin can take his rightful place as first of the dead and claim a second illustrious life. You are mine. Our true champion. And though I can't be of any use to you, can I hold you tight? If only for a moment. Yeah, sure. I mean, I literally cannot stop you. But hey, a better version that you get only one of. I will soon lay with Godwin, and it will surely stir within me. The new life of the Golden Prince and first dead of the demigods, as the rune of those who live in death. Please, do one thing for me. Brandish this child, my rune, and take for yourself the throne. Stay the persecution.
execution of those who live in death by becoming our Elden Lord. I will soon yeah, okay. brandish my stave upon I become. You got it. You do your thing, I will do my thing. I will also I have the thing that's like buffing my health. Dude, I'm gonna just gonna uh, oh mind, let me just get rid of this because kind of it's probably been hurting me a fair bit this entire time. Give me that health back. How dare you. Now then. Oh, but you're still lit. Oh. I thought... Don't you... You're supposed to... Why aren't you doing the thing? Don't you want to do the thing? What's going on here? Why are you not doing the thing? Yeah, okay. This is goodbye, my dear. Oh, there we go. But I am satisfied. I choose to lie with Godwin of my own will. Not the remains of one chosen for me. And I will bear a child who will inherit your womb, too. What greater blessing could there be but to be born a deathbed companion? This is goodbye. I choose and I will be willing in what greater Okay, now now do the thing. If you don't mind, please. I just I, I need you to do the thing. You we're both doing our best. I need you to do better. So you you just do that. And I'll just go here. You see. When I turn back around. Eh, she's doing the thing. Perfect. It. Well, I'll eat it. We'll see what happens. And now we go into her dreams because we can just do that. Don't question it. It's how it works. Sometimes these things happen and we just got to deal with it. And now uh, we go fight an undead zombie dragon who is crackling with what? Uh, yeah, lightning stuff. Things. As you can tell, things are a little intense. Oh god, right, that's the frickin' ground waves. Does he have fire? I don't know. Oh, oh god. Lord. I don't even know what was adding more friggin'. That play to me. Ow. Why are you the way that you are? Why can't you be so much easier to target? God. Alright. Screw it. No more lock-on. You're not helping. Tell me that's just you're just shooting that forward, right? Not going down. Ow. Uh, it, it is. It wasn't back. Just going forward. Oh lord. Ow. If you don't mind, thank you. Just gonna keep stabbing your ankles back here, and we're both gonna have a good time. Oh my god. What are you doing? I don't know what you're doing, but I don't think I like it. Oh, you're doing the AoE. Okay, you know what? That's fine, actually. You will go that. Uh, where did you go? Oh, that's where you went. Oh. Oh, yeah, we're doing this now, huh? Cool. This is good. This is good. I'm enjoying this. Alright, no more sips. Who needs sips? 
Not me. Looks like cowards. And I frankly don't understand how that missed me, but sure. Baby, the pop of the frost. Ooh, actual first try. Booyah. Well, that went way better than I thought it was going to go. <laughs> Alrighty, well. Uh, unfortunately, killing the green dragon has... Uh, well, it has spawned a JPEG that exists in 3D space, which, uh, you know, reminds me of the good old days. Just hanging out playing Doom. I'll take that, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, hope you're, hope you're doing alright, Fia. I realize it was super cool that I killed that guy first try. I know you may have had, like, a heart attack from, like, the sheer panic and admiration you felt me at the moment, but... I hope you can recover. I believe in you. I trust you'll be fine. I'm gonna go spend all these runes before I lose them in a horrible, horrible, stupid mistake. Uh, yeah, this. Okay, 7,000 more. 7,000 more. Ha! Princess Death. Take a good, long look. See the wrath ah. of the Golden Order. The Order's justice writ in blood. This hmm. is what's become of your precious witch naught but expired meat and bone this is a proper death oh prince look at this rotten whore no well rude there you, you gotta you chill useless flesh behold your mother is dead <laughs> this is revenge you witch and you, you ghoul, this is the wrath of D. Well, I may be complicit in this since I gave that guy the armor and weapon, but uh, let's try not to think about that and just uh, grab this. Be his hood and rope. Cool, cool, cool. Um, hi, do you want to fight? Do you think I'm involved in this? How's, what's going on? Uh, hello. The rotten witch is dead. The golden order unsullied. Now I can look my brother Darian in the eye. Honeyed rays of gold deliver my spirit. Darian, now I have no regrets. Honeyed rays of gold deliver my spirit. Alrighty then. Darian. Uh, yep, yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good. Okay, alright. Uh... Pop a little 7,000 souls here, if uh, you don't mind. I'm just gonna... You just keep chilling there, my bro. Uh, don't worry about me. It's all good. And he's gone. And... Uh, he left all the stuff. Cool. Cool. Thanks. Good. 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 Good habit. Good. All right, well, glad this all went just swimmingly. Uh, I would say everybody came out with what they wanted. Maybe. Don't really know. But hey, we got stuff, and that's what really matters. All right, so. This. Well, we came here, but we didn't explore. I might run around just a bit there more. There's still all of this, which I will, I will probably check out. And then there's the thing we actually gotta do over here, going up there, and just, you know, having a, having a heck of a time. Actually, I think I'm going to do... I'm gonna 
Okay, yeah, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I have ideas, I have thoughts, I have ambitions. Head out here. Now we can meet up. Should meet up. With a good old friendly friend, pal friend of us. Ours is, be, do, is, yes. You know, I could definitely do better words, but I, I just don't. I don't want to. No time for better words. It's only time for stabbing a giant, giant stone. Things might actually do. I don't think that would have uh, caused him to crumple, but you know what? This is fine. Everything's fine here. This is all good. Oh, don't worry about me. Ignore me. You know what? I'll, I'll ignore you, and you ignore me, and he's not listening, and I should have stabbed him, but you know what? This is fine. This is not fine, I realize. Well, I learned an important lesson, and that is gravity. Alright, well let's try that again with less falling to our death. Possibly even less fighting with the pointless to fight giant stoneman. Then again, they're probably not actually pointless. They're probably gonna shoot me in the back as soon as I run by them, but... Eh. It's fine. It's, it's, it's fine. It's totally fine. It's not fine, but I want to pretend it's fine, and... Oh, that guy stays dead if you kill him. Hmm. I wonder if that means the other ones would stay dead if I killed him. Well... I guess we'll find out later. Oh, not at all. Ow. Alright. Thank you for taking that hit, Torrent. Proud of you. You are one tanky goat horse donkey thing. And that is rule game. Oi, what's going on, mate? What are you looking at? Oh, you again, is it? Perfect bloody timing, actually. I got crab cooked up fresh. Oh, I noticed. Oh, crikey! Why? Why? I was just hanging out with my friend, Mr. Dragonfly. Why are you gonna be like this? Stop! Please! More. Oh my god, he's just... Why? Why are you like this? I was having a nice chat, and then you just had to come over here and... Hit me like a friggin' rocket. Alright, alright, hi, hey, what's... What's going on? You, you got crab? I know it's my I noticed. What's up with the crab? Greatly boosts physical but damage negation for a certain duration. Unlike the prawn so it's truly crab. Not that it matters. It's delicious all the same. Prime specimen of plump and moist meat. Brew connoisseurs know how to keep from over salting. Buy some crab. You can never go wrong buying some crab. Hey, there's something I should probably tell you. You heard of the dung eater? Yes. Madman. Has it out for everyone. Curses him. Goes round in his rank armor and all. You see him though. Stay well away. I was in the same jail as he once, so I know first hand. He's a god forsaken monster. Not just some petty thug like me. Understood, mate. Understood. He's a killer. Kills people. And curses the souls. Does all sorts of shit to the corpses. To keep them cursed forever. I well, that's concerning considering his name. In all my years, I've never been more scared and weird. Rooted to the bloody spot. While he did that. To my friend. Ah. So, uh... Yeah, someone with a taste for crab I couldn't trust. You've got a real thing here, eh? A 
and it's only getting better. You're damn right, mate. You're damn right. All right, then. So, now that we've had that established, we're on a bit of a trip. Let's have a bit of a chat. Assuming I can remember how to get there. Hopefully. Probably. Ideally. We can have... We can have some words. Certain fellow. And also just, you know, going to ignore the giant omen men as much as possible. Good lord, those guys just beat the hell out of me. Nice to hear you guys also beat the hell out of me, so you know what? Good job. Oh, you're still alive. Okay, well, never mind. Glad, uh, glad we had that chat. Good exchange. Good exchange. All right, let's let's just save ourselves some trouble here, shall we? Yeah, that's what I thought. Are you a problem? No, okay. Well, you're not until you will be. But I guess we'll find out when that happens. I was really hoping you went around that fast. Very sad you didn't I just fall off. Like that, thank you. Perfect. That's what I was hoping for. Number six. I need a summer eight though, not summer six. Still good pickup though, so yeah, fair enough. Seven. Like those big numbers. Very big fan. Oh, yeah, okay. Hi, hi. Hmm. Well. You a problem. Oh, God, yeah, you're a problem. I have range magic, too, because, you know what, why not? Hurt like hell. Let's stagger. They take their time on their swings. Ow. Oh, at least I got this. By this, I mean I I don't have anything going for me in this situation. This is all bad. Oh, okay. He was about to explode and murder me, I bet. Yeah, see, that's why I much prefer ignoring those guys, because good lord. Good lord. They are brutal. They are tough. And they are mean. And now I'm just opening up a way to get back to where I started with more of them. Good. Good. Totally great. Yeah, that's it's just where I came from. I don't need to... Go the other way. I'm just gonna not. I'm just gonna go back this way and have a much better time. Now I just have to deal with tiny little gremlins falling from the sky on me. Or, you know, crawling up from below. Also viable. At least I can do this. Save myself some trouble. I appreciate how determined this guy is for his ambush. He's he's really hanging in there. He's ready. He's ready. He believes. He can do it. And oh god, he has a friend. It's a off cliff. Or not. Ah. Uh. Oh. 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 Mm -hmm. All right, well, that happened. Okay. I don't really have uh, an appropriate response for what that was, but I sure did. 
It sure did. Oh. You. Hmm. Interesting. Am I dead? I'm dead, aren't I? No, oh, never mind. Distance, it's just, I don't understand it. I do not understand it in the least. And now I have to play Metal Gear Crab. Fins of the Fallen Triads. Oh god, what? Oh, Jesus. Dun, 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 dun. Why do they hurt so much? They're just, they're just freaking crabs. They do so much damage. Everything still seven. Great, cool, cool. Really happy about that. It's gonna dodge if you don't mind. Grace, Grace, great. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, thank. Oh, hello, my dear friend. All right. So, yeah, you're just you're just hanging out right there, and you decide to aggro from a very far distance away. Or when I'm just right nearby. Just have to deal with that fact. Alright, well we have a grace right by, so let's... How much damage do you take? Oh, well, you take a fair amount. But boy, you dish out way more. God. Why? Why are giant lobsters so deadly? Why are you the greatest foe in this video game? I don't understand. And I don't enjoy being punched to death by a giant angry crustacean. There they are, alright. Have this. Yeah, okay, I understand. You're very upset. I'm very upset about your existence too, but you know what? I'll learn to live with it. You'll have to learn to live with mine. Where in the world are we now? These are ghosts. Hello, ghosts. What are you doing? Besides being jerks and shooting me with crossbows. Not much, it seems. Not much. Oh, you're respawning. That's what you're doing. Cool. Uh, ah! Cool. Uh. Oh! Okay, hi! Alright, thank you for clipping through the wall and let me know you're here. Alright, so that's your gimmick. We have nails in walls that are causing ghosts to internally respawn. That's a gimmick and a half, I'll tell you what. What does this do? Not entirely sure what that lever just did. Oh. Oh, that's what that lever did. Okay, that's a full on link shortcut. Alright, well, I'm not going to touch anything to do with that guy, so. Uh, down the other way we go. This whole wall touch now, and it's gonna be paranoid that, like, there's snails everywhere. I'm gonna have to do the most impossible thing of all and try and trust messages to not betray me. Da 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 da. There's a message up there. I wonder if there's an invisible wall up here. I take that as a no. Alright, cool. You know what? Nice to have that reprieve. That's just death. No reason to go down that way. Means 
Let's go this way. Okay, um... Ah, oh, yes, the coordinated zombie bar from. Why would I expect anything else? You lied to me, Master. You lied to me. What I get? This is what I get. All right. It seems like a very gross room full of some very gross people. And that's fire, so that's also cool. Okay, all right. Calm down with the horrible screaming noises. It's it's not it's not a good listen. It's not a good noise. Ooh. All right. Now, let's deal with you. Clever way. Actually. Alright. Let's deal with you. Oh, wait, no, wait, no. Damn it. Let's deal with you. The sneakily clever way. Also, because we have this handy dandy Mo shackle. Fetish bathed in gold magic. Shackles were once used to bind the accursed people called the Omen. These ones were made to keep a particular omen under strictest confinement. No faint. The shackles still re retain vestiges of power, enough to trap the once-bound Moog on Earth, but only for a short time. Or, because it happens to be a global hitbox, you can just do this. And save yourself a whole lot of trouble. I believe that also pops the loser of all, so you know, if there are any of those around, hopefully they won't be anymore. Gross. I wanted to get on top of that. Alright, let's get shall we? Alright, beam me up, Captain. Or anything else? You please? Just you. Oh, you're aware of me. I was really hoping you weren't. But okay. Do this then. I have no problem laming you out, sir. You are incredibly deadly. And I'm not the biggest fan of fighting you. Alright, well, so much for laming it out. Oh, never mind. Okay. Oh, good. That's why you were hanging back so much. Because you're too fat to fit in here. Alright, you can just come back to where I can see you. That'd be. You do just have a body explosion. A buffing body explosion. Cool. Really cool. I have no idea how that works, but you know what? I'll take it. I will take that so happily. Much better way to go about this. I don't know why I did it this way. Uh, the talisman fashioned from a scale that embodies the aspects of various creatures said to have grown on the human body long ago. Reduces damage taken from critical hits, a vestige of the crucible of primordial life, born partially of devolution, who was considered a signifier of the divine in ancient times, is now increasingly disdained as an impurity as civilization has advanced. Alright. 
this nice little dead end room, we can just get on out of here. Oh, right, yeah, you're still hanging out. Hi. I appreciate you. Let me recharge. There's we go. Where there are already corpses hanging out. That's. Oh, well, they're not real corpses. That's okay. Ah. Hi. You realize you don't have your horns. And all your stuff knocked off. Interesting. You're also way easier than all the other ones, so thank god for that. Weird. I thought all the guys down here were supposed to have their horns. But, I mean, hey, evidence says otherwise. Oh, is this zombie barf room? Well, no, if this was zombie barf room, there'd be zombies barfing. And there are the zombies. No. I left that down when I... What is happening? I just go in a circle. Good enough. No, cause yeah, no, this is the missing There's the guy I chained backstabbed. He should be here. Now this is where we go up. Okay, I'm I'm this is new. Okay. It's just... Was incredibly similar to what was here before. Got it. Good the trick. Good little practical joke. So don't go down there. A ladder. What do you bring me to? A ladder. Nice long empty hallway. My favorite. But a nice long empty hallway. Zombie. Hello. Hello. Hi. 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 How are you doing? Nice to meet you. Good chat. Bud. And the opening of the boss door. This is all... Alright. Down, I assume... This was zombie barf room. This was the first zombie barf room I walked into. That would get me back to the start and let me actually go to the boss. But... There was another way I didn't go. Let me check that out first before I go hopping back down into Zombie Barf Room. Man, what a tricky little dungeon where they make it all the same on purpose just to screw you up. God, that's mean. That is... I would consider it diabolical. Even call it rude. Okay, yes. This is the room I came in down. It's first off north. 
what is first off north here? Oh, it's, it's just that. Okay, this. Wait, did we... No, wait. Okay, no, that the zombie. Okay, it's a circle. It's a circle. It's a circle. Don't think it. Don't overthink it. It's clearly a circle. Everything's fine. Everything's great. There is no problem here. No, oh, there's a problem here. You are a sneaky jerk, and I don't appreciate you. And that's what sneaky jerks that I don't appreciate get. This is not a boss. This does not have a boss health bar. There was no fog door. This is not the right thing. Okay, yes, you are alone. Good for me. Ow. Hell of a right book. Oh, it's swing, too. Ow. Man. You know, the wrong calls on you. There's, there's got to be a boss here, right? Like, I, I, this, this cannot be correct. Because there wasn't, but I mean, that is the boss door that opened when you pull the lever. Like, that wasn't a boss boss. That was just some tough guys. So I have no idea what I'm doing. If. It's a the way I came in didn't have something at middle table. This is a dead end. This is okay. Okay, I understand. Yep, 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 yep. That it was a fake boss room. The way I came in, which I would like to go back, but I can't because got these zombies aggroed at me. The way I came in had the real boss door. This was a fake a deep koi boss, because why wouldn't they not? Oh, oh god, okay, uh, I didn't realize that was a denial. Okay, ow! You are threatening, and I don't appreciate that. Back at the start. And here's the real door that's open with the real boss. So, what do we got? Esger, Priest of Blood. He's wearing a pyramid head on his head. Okay. Okay, and he's doing lots of bleed. Big old bleed party. Cool. Ow. Oh. That's no good. That is decidedly poor. Just chill for a second, Mr. Esker. I happen to be a big fan of bleed myself. In case you haven't noticed. Also, wow, that hood. Good lord. Lord of Blood's Exultation. What the heck is that? Blood loss in vicinity increases attack power. Render up your offerings of blood to your lord. Drench my consort's chamber. Slake his cocoon's thirst. His awakening shall herald the dawn of our dynasty. Alright. That actually would be kind of good for my build with, with the two katanners and the big old bleed dee 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 dee. I mean, 
have a think about this. It will be considered very heavily. I guess now I have to go back to hang out with the crabs. Hmm. I don't really want to go back to hang out with the crabs, but... It seems you've left me with no other option. So... Man, Torrent, you are so lucky you don't have to come down here. Alright, time to run. Flee from crab. Pray for salvation from crab. Crab offers no salvation, only pain. Oh god, there's nothing else down here, is there? There's nothing else down here. This is just a dead end. There's nothing down here but crab the pain. Well. This is what I get. This is what I get for coming back for a crab. There's gotta be something else. There's gotta be something else. Is there... No, that's nothing under that waterfall. That's just poop. That's just nasty poop stuff. Ah. This... No, this is just a dead end. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, all right, well, now that we've examined that complete dead end, time to leave. Time to just get out of here. Okay, all right, let's, let's try heading back up to the top. The good old subterranean shun on the ground. I went down the first time. Item here. Let's soak my check. And a mask. Another hole to fall down. Great. I bet I'm still going to have to deal with that guy coming down after me. And now I'm dead, so I don't. Perfect! Rather than die to Spooky Omen Man, I chose the death of Rat, and you know what? I'm okay with that. It was probably faster. Now we know another way to go. Let's see where this brings us. Why are rats so effective at comboing? Bolus, I bet those are going to be useful. Box rat! That rat needs to box rat! That rat, he was in a box that you saw away from Dark Souls 1. He's been waiting for that ambush for so long. He was ready. He was ready. He was waiting. He knew what he wanted, and oh, good lord. Alright, well. I'm just gonna not go by. I'm just gonna. There get poison. Ah, damn it. Oh, that's concerning. Dangerously close. Stick with the fine. More of that. Cool. I see that. I see that. Ah, of course you guys are down here too. I want you to be. Well, at least we deal with the big one easy. Locked. Oh, I screwed up, didn't I? I did. I did, I did, I did. <laughs> well. Time to fix that mistake. Hey, buddy. I hear you're kind of an asshole. I hear you're kind of a big problem. No. Wait. You have felt the curse or 
can smell it on you. Fox, yet tender. Apparently my seedbed is ripe and waiting. It was a brief respite, I must say. Go and unshackle my corporeal flesh, trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. I can kill you and defile your corpse. I'm gonna, gonna opt out of that, if you don't mind. Good, I'm good. Go and unshackle trapped in this sewer. I can gain the pox. Okay, yeah, you, you know, yeah, we'll, we'll be seeing you. Oh, we will be seeing you. Oh, okay. Worth picking up. Yeah, okay. Doot doot. Get a couple of these, why not? You never have too much starting materials. Alright. Did I pick up any actual upgrade materials I can use? Well, I took you, my man, to lay out your own. That is a no. Alright. Gonna hurt to check. Alright. Well then. Back to the underground. true hero. Best of his kind. Best of all of us, really. Who else would be brave enough to just hide in a box for countless eons waiting for someone to walk by just so he could leap out and go, yeah, Gotcha! Nyeh, 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 nyeh. Oh, I was really hoping you guys wouldn't activate. Oh, god. You, you just keep on doing whatever the hell you're doing. Don't hear. Ah, I got other problems to deal with. Am I dead? Somehow not dead. Cool. Ow. Here. I hope nobody hits me. Would appreciate that a lot. Oh god, you're right there. around. Oh, he turned around. Okay, well, this is fine. This is planned. Ah, well, at least we got to see a flower do a flip. Getting worse and worse for me. Why are you still here? Why are you like this? Couldn't you just not? See, see, that's all it takes for you to just not. Ah. There's more of you. Alright. Well, that went not ideally. Everything that matters to you for generations to come. You were just going the whole time, huh? Oh, he just loves being evil. Let's see if we can get him to hear his noise again. I kind of would like to actually have that full... ...raised, angry, freakish rant. But, I mean, if he's just gonna, you know, keep... ...keep doing what he's doing... I guess we can go introduce ourselves. Yeah, okay, okay, he's done. In that case... Who are you? Oh, I am the Dawn Gator. A scourge upon the living. I must eat more. Defile more. 
it's all about that. You, uh, you know, you seem like kind of a problem. And, uh, yeah, we can't have that. Normally, I don't approve of, uh, randomly killing NPCs. Dung Eater's no good. Nothing good happens from Dung Eater. You get an ending, but it's one of the endings that's just kind of a variant of another ending. So you know what? Just save yourself the trouble. Get your, get your goodies. Get your omen gear, your sort of Milos. And, uh, spare yourself from having to deal with that. Because it is not worth it. Yeah, Mr. Great Short fashioned from a giant's backbone. Meets out wounds like a lopsided saw blade. Restore some FP upon defeating an enemy. Milos was undersized for a giant and was viewed as sullied and terribly grotesque. And then you have his poopo armor. Malformed armor resembling an omen with its horns cut off. Worn by the Dung Eater. The heavy sun-shaped medallion represents both the guidance he once saw and the ring to which it will one day lead. And... Worn by the Dung Eater, its form is a vision of the landscape of his mind, and of his appearance as he wished to see it. The heart of an omen without the body to match. Would there be any crueler existence? What does it matter, then, if the curse claims it all? Okay. Just the body as the different description. But yeah, you know, this is you can you can tell. Dung eater, no good. Don't don't hang out with dung eater. Have the legs dung eater. I keep trying to eat your dung, and really, it's just I, no one wants that. It's really not worth it. Just it's just bad. So close, three thousand. Also, I haven't commented on it, but in one of the updates, they made it so that the things actually tell you how much they're worth, and man, that is just so good. That is one of the nicest quality of life updates they have ever given. And it's gonna be really weird when the next game, when they decide to not have that in by default. Because they, they'll do it. They will not do it. They will do the not. They'll... They, you, you, you get what I mean. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, that's a hole. I didn't realize that was a hole. Well, now I'm down here with the slugs. Slugs. Lugapalooza. I guess this makes sense, like what I thought. Hmm. Understood. Have a nice day. Okay, that's where I fell. Oops, this is a different direction. Which also has a hole that I don't want to fall down. Goes to arrow fletch. Doorway. Ow! All right. You guys are some of the most damaging slugs I have ever met. That's a sincere compliment, even though I don't really know why it would be. Yep, yep, okay, well, mm hmm. Uh, 
Oh, you can actually fit in here. Oh no. All right. Well, this is a shame. Oh, oh, you have. Okay, I didn't realize that gave you those. Oh Lord. Oh, well, this is not as bad a situation as it could be. Oh, it's even worse. Yep. Yep. It's bad. Alrighty. Oh, that area is going to be such a pain to navigate through. I have a goal. I know what my goal is to reach at the end of the stream. Problem is going to be actually navigating there. Because, ooh. Oi. Ay, 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 ay. Fox rat! So proud of that guy. So proud of that guy. Never gonna get tired of that. Every single time I go past there, I will comment on the glory of Box Rat. Oop, oop, oop. Where is the ambush? Probably, you know what? Yeah, I should, I should really kill the rest of you because I'm probably going to be backing up through here very soon. And the last thing I need is a bunch of poo poo slugs getting in my way. But I'm trying to flee like a true hero. Alright then. Are you... Okay, yeah, you are facing this way. That's why you know the top down. It's really hard to tell. You kind of just look like a horrible, horrible mess of all sorts of crap. That was my problem. I should have been more aggro. I fear them, but I don't necessarily need to respect them. This is a bad spot. I don't like this spot. This is. You guys chill and ignore me. Let me open this lovely, lovely shortcut. That is not a lovely, lovely shortcut. That is not what I thought it was at all. Oh no. I can open this at least. This is a shortcut. Hope so, I think. Probably. Okay, yes, this is actually a shortcut. Good. Good, 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 good. good. Whatever that item is, really worth fighting two of you? Probably not. You know what? I have a plan. Ignore me! Oh, I didn't get the item. Well, yeah, okay, Smithing Stone 7. Yeah, it's not really worth it. Got it, though! And open the gate, so don't have to go through all that yet. And instead, I'll just have to deal with the two normal ones that are hanging out in that... Ignore me, ignore me, ignore me, ignore me. Ignore me, ignore me, ignore me. They ignore me, ignore me, ignore me. Oh, why would they do that right there? Well, this is fine. Honestly, I probably just could have left that. I really don't need 9,000 souls. It's not that much, but you know what? It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Everything's great here. I'm sure they can't actually fit down here. Give me a free heal. Thank you. Drive that. Oh god, let's fuck them. Oh no. Uh, sorry, just pardon me, just pardon me. Just pardon me. Yep. 
Alright, well, I wanted to backstab you, but I guess that's just not in the cards. There we go. Oh, they're still mad. They're still mad at me. Zone 6. Death. Cool. And some string. appreciate these zombies, guys. It's so nice having just free health and FP sitting around. Yeah, that's not going anywhere. Got it. Oh, why, why are you plants here? The giant booby sword. You, you need sunlight. You can't live here. I've decided. You, you're all evicted. Go home. Be a family plant. Oh, actually, oh no, it is not actually a dead end. I was, ah. Uh, no, I, ah, uh, ah. Uh, ah, uh, why does that be you guys down the sewers again? Why is it always basilisks in the sewers? Of course, why would it? I'm gonna get blindsided by one, aren't I? Shockingly, I was not. Oh, come on, I was being, I was in sneaking pose. This is rude. You're very rude. Immediately, like, come on, bro. I meant to get the repose there, but you know what? This works too. The Omen Bear! And a cleaver. Oh, so I guess that means that guy was special. Hopefully that means he won't come back, ever. I would not want to see him. So what is an omen bear? In what is it? Um, no. Usable item? Yep, usable item. Use FP to only wraiths that will chase down foes. Omen babies have all of their horns excised, causing most to perish. These fetishes are made to memorialize them. Please don't hate me or curse me. Please. You know, understandable. I think we'd all share that sentiment. Firstly, I really hate being cursed. Really inconvenient to get it undone. And now we're back here. With you guys. Having a grand old time. But more importantly, even better shortcut that doesn't lead me to being chased by four angry, angry men with cleavers. Good. Real fan of that. What is going on in this direction? Firebombs. We should not have firebombs. You know what? You can you can just chill there. That's fine. You enjoy yourself. Can I get there from here? I can. I don't think I want to. There. Okay, now, yeah, that, this is different from where I could get to before. Okay, so let's 
Head on down. Better? I didn't need to fall safely on this. Your aim sucks. Thank you for being awful. Under there, but I think that's just a dead end. Hard to tell. But this way has less imps, as far as I can tell. Let's do this. To the pipe! I have absolutely no idea where I am now. Let's go down that way. Oh, that's a big rat. I saw that big old tail. Ooh, be a big bubba. Not a boo. How about you, babu? That's another hole. And now I'm back to where I started. Damn it. Just falling down that first hole. Made my life so much easier a bit. But hey, shortcut at least. That helps. And... 10 ball corner pocket. Well, let's actually see what's down this way. Why not? On the hole, that means we can actually come back. Ooh, hey. I don't actually need you, but I'll kill you anyway. Oh, this place is a maze. Well, hey. Oh, wait, no. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? No! I was planning on using you. That's why I healed a fool? That's what I get, I guess. Things don't aim, that's good. Is this actually a dead end? Weird, I would have assumed that there would be more. You have to mock me. They get to get out of here. Shoo. Alright, 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 alright. So this area that I don't remember how to get to or cordon off. I have reached a dead end. Oh, hey, you yes, get down. No, get back here. I need you. Gimme. That's what I get from missing your friend. And okay, this is also a dead end. Good. I can just never come back here ever then. You uh, what? Okay, you know what? Nah, I don't. Eh, I should dance through it. For the principle of the thing. And now I'm not gonna get you anyway. Perfect. Somewhere new that I haven't been? I what? Wait, what? Ah! I'm so lost. I am so lost. I am so lost. I thought I was coming back to where I was before, but now there's all these scarabs and stuff. It's stuck in the tubes. I'm stuck in the internet. Wait, right, where is this? This. Been here. I've been here. Yes. Okay. I don't need this. This is nothing for me. I have been there. Done that. Don't need to do that again. 
I really needed to do was to remember where the hell those rats were. That invisible wall. Ah. I mean, I'm glad it's not, because that just makes this place even more confusing, but ah. I don't know where I'm going. I'm probably just backtracking. Okay, this, this, this is it. This is where the rats are. Okay, okay, we're back to business. This is the first hole where people recommended it, but I'm taking a rain check. And then up here, second sneaky hole, after which is, is just a loop, and I didn't need to do that at all. Okay. All right, then down we go. Rude. Give that back. All that help. Thank you. Don't appreciate that. Oh, God. That really sucks that I fell down that second hole then. Give myself a whole lot of time. All right, Jar Bros. Y'all, you know what? You're good. You're good, you guys. I don't, I don't got no beef. You are good. What a lovely, convenient race. Be from here, right down here. I don't even need to rest now that I think about it, but I might as well. And... Let's see what shenanigans we get up to down here. up, Mr. The Omen. Oh, oh, there was fire there, and that was a very delayed overhead. Okay. Good first showing. Good first showing, Mr. The Omen. And by first showing, I mean technically second, because I'm pretty sure I poked around him before, but you know what? Let's not think about that. It's fine. It's all totally fine. Very nice of them to have a handy dandy warm up fight for the real Moog. I want that too. I could even use a shackle, but. Eh, we'll see how it goes. It should be fine. Uh, not if I fail to understand that overheads are very delayed. It's so slow, it's so slow. Just wait, Just be patient, that's all you gotta do. Alright, don't be patient on that one, that one you gotta, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta take action. Days, I will learn. Not right now, apparently. Not even close. I, wow, dude, yeah. Second longer. One, maybe 1.5 seconds later. 
You're fine to roll whenever. Hey, just be patient and smart and recognize things. Oh, uh, oh, yes. Wow, just right off the bat, just giving yourself a shower. I'm on blood fire. Uh, you know, I don't really know how that one worked, but I'll take it. Ow. chance to heal. I definitely didn't deserve it. And I that He's actually tougher than I thought. I kind of assumed I'd be a bit over leveled for him, but now he's he's hanging in there. He is doing his job. such simple attacks too it's just delayed it's just delayed and my brain cannot comprehend the simple fact that i'm just going to wait a second it's you and then then i definitely will because you are a fool and you know nothing i'ma get you mogi i'ma get you one way or another. Ow. You know, good anti air. Can't complain. Definitely deserve that. I, you know, I don't feel like I deserve that, but I definitely hate it. So, you know what? Fair enough. That time I thought I at least waited long enough, but I didn't wait enough. One, and... Snap. How about that time at least? Ow. One, and two! Ow! Also, just stop feeling like an absolute dumbass. Wow, he gets some distance on that. I assumed I was far enough away to be safe. 
what I get. That was quite possibly the worst run I've ever seen. Nothing, you don't listen to them and wait. What? All right, starting off with a little shower. That's cool. Appreciate you being fresh and clean for our fight. He does three. When he wants to, he does three. Pulls the swing, and that's the overhead, and I am just a horrible mess. That at least. Take a little comfort again in that. I can't get that anymore though. I could, I used to, but now, not at all. Not even close. He has a third. He has a third that he brings out every now and again when he really wants it. Should have swung, should have swung, should have swung. Okay, alright. A little bit, a little bit getting in there, a little bit getting in there. I should really consider the shackle. I don't think I need it. I believe in myself enough to be able to get through this without it. But... Well, that's the thing, actually. Actual Mog is indeed very susceptible to bleed. This guy, though? Because he's a ghost, he's not the real Moog. Uh, he don't care. He don't care at all. I don't. I haven't even noticed Frost go on it. On him, so I think he's just kind of immune because I mean he's a ghost, so not to worry about being old or bleeding or you know all those other fun mortal things. Yeah, he did three. Remember that he does three. That's the overhead, and I'm just the worst when it comes to that. The direct. Because I keep thinking he's doing something else. I keep assuming it's not the overhead. Like, I'm assuming it's the swings. But no, it, it's the overhead. It's always the overhead, except when it's not. Okay, that was too bad on my part. Swing. And swing. And three. Alright, well, I mean, that wasn't exactly a three, but it was a three. Yeah, there's a couple bosses like that where they're immune to status effect. Granted, on most of them, it's a bit more obvious because they actually look ghostly, whereas this guy looks real, but is, you know, not. Which, honestly, kind of makes me wonder of lore implications, because there's always lore implications. Like, maybe uh, the reason he looks real is because this was meant to be... The equivalent of a pillow under the covers, so his parents didn't know that he snuck out of his prison under the capital. So the title just being Mo the Omen. I mean, it definitely has to mean something, considering the other one's a Lord of Blood. 
This is just the simple mode. Just uh, hanging out, sitting on his bed, kicking his legs while looking at questionable magazines. We don't worry about it. We don't think about it. Uh, we definitely do not ask Morgoth about it. Very embarrassed by his brother. And oh my god, I dodged an overhead. I'm not intending to do a no ashes challenge run, but I kind of started doing it unintentionally because there were a couple bosses earlier that I did just fine without ashes. I'll probably, you know, give him a shot in like a spit. I don't know. When I feel like it. When it seems necessary. As it is, like, I mean, right now it doesn't feel necessary. I just need to, you know, keep doing that. That's good. I'm so proud of myself for doing that. Not so proud about just eating the blood spray in my face, but, you know. Baby steps. Now, him being immune to status effect does kind of hurt my plan a lot, considering I'm using Frost Katanas. So my whole plan is sort of in the gutter, but, eh, you know, adapt, overcome, improvise, not getting hit by friggin' blade swings. Like that, see? Do that more. Don't do that, though. That's not good. We don't like that. Only villains do that. Not that. This is not what I wanted to do. I mean, I guess this is fine as well. Okay. Killer, I kind of need you to not block my view. In the zero hour. I was a little too late on that heal. I could that one. Stop sucking. Just stop sucking. The heal off of this. I don't know why. Ah! Thought he wasn't doing the third swing. I got him now. I got him. And yeah, backwards rolling's just a uh, horrible, horrible habit I have. Ever since Dark Souls 1, it's just in my brain. I feel like there's only certain bosses fights where I've just run them so much that I broke my habits. But then as soon as I go back to something else, it's just immediately... Just go backwards. Because of course you want to go backwards. You want to run away from danger, not into it. Even though, no, that's very wrong. You're going back into danger and rolling forward out of it. Ah, oh, well, I, I, I would assume that you would not be in the way. And, uh, there's more. No. I did it. I dodged an overhead. Everybody praise me. I'm so proud. I'm damn that I do that. Doing the third? Oh my god. Okay. 
no. And of course, then he does a third. And fourth. Because, yeah. that heal? Probably not. I decided to do it anyway because I felt like it. Yes. Thank you for respecting that sip. Wow, I, I assumed you would have just murdered me there. And like that, see? Ugh. I wonder how quickly he'd go down if I brought out the Mimic. Probably very quickly. Well, he does have the super wide swings and everything. It's just him not having the focus on me. We just blast him with magic and have a good old time. It's a witch. I wonder. Hmm. I'm probably going to regret trying to throw this out. But I am curious to see how well it would work. There are points where I think he decides to stay very still. Like this. And uh, if I was ready more, I could have tossed it out and seen what happens. Get some free DOT. Pokemon, I really don't appreciate your ability to just free combo basically however you please. I don't. I really don't. I, yeah, you know what? Fair. I think that's up to me, though. I think that's just gonna happen. Damn. I was dodging that no problem for a long time. Now I have just completely forgotten how it works.
that's what, okay, that's, I didn't think you were doing that. I thought you were doing something else entirely. Goes me. so many times. I'm laming you out now, Moog. This is what happens. Probably pay attention. I didn't pay attention. Idiot. 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 Gonna lame him out, then lame him out, and... remember to actually dodge the claw. I don't know what went wrong with my brain with that. I was hitting it. I was dodging it. I was having no problem. And then suddenly it's now the new overhead. <sighs> no pillars. I don't appreciate you blocking my camera, but I do appreciate you you screwing up his swings like that. Oh, that's the poor combo. That's uh, the poor combo. Actually dodged the full four hit. Oh my god. I'm a miracle worker. I'm going to die now. Farewell. My final message. Change the world. Goodbye. We'll let him get the complete claw. And then. And then did he get hit by the overhead. Of course they always do. That and just, yep, yep, this is all good. This is all according to plan. He wanted to do two hits. I always think I can fit two hits because two hits is a lot, but no, one hit. One hit's all you can. Work off that. You do your Read it? No. Nope. This one didn't want. Three hit? Nope. Okay. Ooh. Okay with this. You know, I'm about to that, no problem. It's greed! There we go. Greed when it counts. Greed when it counts. Only when it counts. Alright. Oh. Bird tree's favorite plus one. Can I use that? Nah, okay. I still go down to reload. Yeah. I could swap that out for the turtle. I'm gonna actually do that. Alright. That right there is some stuff. Wah. 
Oh god, right. Hey, Melina, what's 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 up? What's going on? Just hanging out down in the you know the old poopy caverns. I am the frenzied flame. I ask that you cease. It is not to be meddled with. It is chaos, devouring life and thought unending. However ruined this world has become, however mired in torment and despair, life endures. Births continue. There is beauty in that. Is there not? If you would become Lord, do not deny this notion. Please. Leave the frenzied flame alone. I'll consider it. Shall I turn your runes to strength? Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. Your thoughts, Pretty bigger. Your ambition. I don't know how high I'm going to pump my vigor. The principles but you would follow. Probably higher than 30. How much? 35 to 40. Somewhere around there. I don't know, but you need... I need more health. I just need... I need to be a healthier lad. More. Oh, wait, whoops. Alright. Uh... Please. Healthy boy. Now, I mean, what, what could Melna possibly be talking about? The whole flame of frenzy. Oh. She have possibly been talking about my favorite area in the whole game. This area. Oh boy. This place is special. I really like this place. And... I could continue on downwards. Yeah, you know what? We're going down. We're going down. Now we just get to, you know, experience this. Oh god, okay, well, uh, yep, we're- okay, well, you know what? Suddenly I've changed my mind. Okay, well, hmm. I was surprised that guy was active. They're usually not. But. Oh well. Sometimes. Sometimes I guess they just feel real uppity. But yeah. I I love this area. It's, it's just like. You walk in and you see this. And then you have the violin music going, and it's just like... It's something special. It's a real, real moment. Okay, and I... Could you, okay, I, I don't appreciate you. I'm trying to have a nice moment here talking about this cool area, and you just keep shooting me with laser insanity eyeballs. <sighs> Some people. No manners. Just all insanity... Space Ripper stinging eyes in you. I'm in the damn Icarus humors. Okay, here you are. We're not. No more. No more. We're done. We're done with you. Okay? And that's, this is the even crazier part of this area, is that there's still some people alive down here, just doing, doing whatever, existing in the insanity zone. Okay, good, he did break the thing. It's just, it's just nuts. It's just such an interesting area. 
this this is I don't know. I'm pretty really bad at putting my words into words, but I'm sure thinking them real hard. And I hope you can accept that as an answer. that you can just, like, these guys are enemies. You can attack them, you can aggro them, or you can just leave them to their music. And, I mean, it's a real good song. I am happy to leave them to it. Meantime... We have the reason why I probably was considering not doing this tonight. Because, oh god. This freaking platforming. Walk off it. I can do that. Thank you. Alright. Uh, well. It's kind of unfortunate. Ah, uh, oh, oh. Okay, hey, I lived. Did it. First try. Woo, wow, I'm kind of shocked I made it. Woohoo. Oh. So, let's touch this, and before we sit, though. What's up? Hey, Hieta. It's been a while. How in the hell did you get down here? So you're here as well. I realized as we've talked, I'll be a maiden, and you, surely a lord, go to the door ahead. After divesting yourself of your possessions, it will surely open, and the three fingers will welcome you. May the flame of chaos find purchase within you. No, I'll consider it. Ahead. I will surely consider that. You. But before we do that... Well, we have a chat with our other fine maiden. What, what do you have to say about this, Melna? How do you feel? What's your thoughts? I ask you one more time. Please, seek not the frenzied flame. As one who strives to become a lord, deny not the lives, the new births of this world. Those who would are not fit to be called lord. When the land they preside over is lifeless. Please, put a stop to this madness. The Lord of Frenzied Flame is no Lord at all. When the land they preside over is lifeless. Alright. I have heard both of your arguments. And, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll leave that for now. But for fun fact, hey look, it is the loser roll down here. Wow, we wow. And a rune arc. But then another illusionary wall. And then we're just, you know, we're down there. So. Touch this grace. Have a sit. And then. I think that's going to be it for today. We have made progress. And we didn't do much, admittedly. I mean, we got married to Rani. That was cool. And we went hang out over here. And that was, that, you know, that was a sure adventure. There was sure some stuff that happened there. And then we fought Moog for an hour and uh, beat him up. And now we're underground in a dark pit. And if we want, we could go become the god of the crazy laser eye people. That's fun. That's a good, good session, if I do say so myself. So, thank you all for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed. I'll be back next week doing something else. Probably more progress. Probably we'll try to do progress at some point. Who knows? We'll find out. Until then, adios.